You want the truth? I think you can handle the truth. I hear a lot of young home buyers discussing this real estate market and their prospects of jumping in. And let's just say what I'm hearing is not encouraging. So let me give you the good news and the bad news. First, the good news. Down payments aren't as big of a deal as you think they are. Saving for a down payment is the number one roadblock most first time home buyers are concerned about. That 20% down payment feels like a huge obstacle. Luckily, there are so many loan programs that don't require the traditional 20% down, some that require nothing down. And programs like down payment systems can help you save even faster. But now to the bad news, waiting is going to cost you. I hear tons of people talking about waiting for the crash to jump into home ownership. To me, that's a risky move. First, no one can predict a housing market crash no matter what their credentials are. And if we are currently in a bubble, we don't know what the effects would be if that bubble bursts. It could cause prices to come crashing down or maybe simply level out and rise at a more predictable rate, in which case prices will still go up. We do know two things. First, demand still greatly outpaces supply and most likely will for the next few years. We also know that interest rates are going up and will likely go up over the next few years. So right now, rates are the lowest they're going to be for the foreseeable future. The point is this, if you're likely to get into home ownership over the next five years, the best time to do it may still be right now. If you're feeling overwhelmed about the idea of buying a house in this crazy market, shoot me a message and let's chat about your options. Thanks for watching.